What is up, lab members and Mad Capsule Marcus fans? There's one here, and today we are looking at this Medicom toy fig by Mad Capsule Marcus for our Science Fiction Sunday. Mad Capsule Marcus is a band I like a lot, and uh, and they they have his their characters. This guy is one of them, and there's two figs in them from Medicoy, Med Medic Med Medicoy, Medicom, and so we're looking at them. Uh, here we have White Crusher by the Mad Capsule Markets, the side of the box, other side of the box, back of the box shows the other character, Black Cybarn. Open it up and you are greeted with the character and then a lot of information. You can pause and read. It's way too much. There we go. Fig itself is rather cool. Medicom is known for uh, making very realistic figs and figs where they're pretty much just dolls. So they have real fabric clothes and such. I'm not going to take this guy out, but I will show you guys a little bit more up close what he looks like. Because articulation on these guys are fine. And if you're interested in articulation, watch any other Medicom toy review I have and you'll be set. Here we have the face. Very interesting that they have plastic that warps the eyes. I love the look of that. It's very Stormtrooper inspired, I feel like, but a very fun fig. And he's got an extra set of hands. Shoes right there. And then on the back, he's got a big ass backpack as well. And we also have a Kubrick version that's somewhat similar. Old dude, very cute, a bit yellow. <laughs> but yeah, that's him. I don't have anything else to show really, besides this being the fig. Size wise, he's as big as a 1 6 scale. So if I get another 1 6, for example, then I. Should be around the same size. Yeah, he is. Sorry, yeah. One six kill fig. And that is the Matt Capsule Markets figure. Very short, but cool. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you. No, I'm going to open them up. Oh, fuck. Okay, I'm going to open them up. Uh, regardless, I'm opening him up. Okay, I'm going to zip some ties off because he's tied around his waist and also his legs. Got to do that if I can. Okay, waist is off. Uh, I want to keep him in the box, but whatever. What review is that? Two minute review to show the guy in the box. Unboxing, not a review. Eh. Okay. It's a shame because these boxes are always so nice, and it's the same with the coming later ones. They're such pretty boxes, and you you're not gonna throw them away. So you kind of want to keep them, but whatever. Ah. The other hand is meant for a gun. I don't think there's a gun that comes with this, or I might not have gotten it. Again, the fig head is just, it, oh crap, yeah, as you can see, wearing an actual undersuit with a zipper, and then you've got the ball jointed head, which I think might be a double ball joint. And I you can look around, do this thing, this fabric is starting to break. Same for the entire undersuit being real fabric. Uh, he is posable until you get to his arm pads, which restrict his movement quite a lot. So it's a high use, you're gonna get them without doing any damage. You see, moving the torso, or it's gonna scratch and turn the undersuit, which you don't want really, due to this being just old. Uh, I think these go like this. Up. 
two pads. And then the backpack here, little zipper, little antenna. It's removable. Don't think it's removable. Okay, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Eru, psai, kongalo.